Come on, then. Don't be sure. I want to see you there. Don't worry, I want to be a friend. Come down and say hello to me. Can you, you smell that? Give a good whiff. Get your nostrils full of it. Can you smell that? Can you smell it? Can you smell it? It's not him. We can all smell stinky here. No, I'm joking. It's about the pies. <laughs> Mrs. Lovett's meat pies, not your fish pies, your apple pies, your sugar pies, no. Mrs. Lovett's meat pies, the best meat pies in all of London. And I ought to know because I am, in fact, Mrs. Lovett. It's me, it's my pie shop. You got every person today, isn't that lovely? You can call me the proprietor. <laughs> Get it? Proprietor. <laughs> all right, I've got another one for you. I just painted this sign here, right? And ever since I did, everyone's asking me, what's the M stand for, Mrs. L? And I say, well, it sounds for Marjorie, my dears. It's the name. But if you really want to butter me up, you call me Marge. <laughs> you call me Marge, is that really? <laughs> <laughs> Should I jump out and scare them so you can watch another lot? Would you like that? Yeah. yeah. Stay put, but then nothing's going on. I'll be right back. Steve, <laughs> 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 and Charlie. Shepherd's pie <laughs> and the uh, fisherman's pie. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, the general pie here, which I do make with or without his privates. <laughs> that was not me. Oh, oh. Um, I don't think you're gonna want these loves. They've gone a bit stale. Great teeth on that. Uh, uh oh. Oh dear. <laughs> don't <laughs> ask me <laughs> Um. Right, and not to worry, my dears, it's, I know it's, it looks like a bit unhygienic, but not to worry, though, it's likely a cat. Sometimes the cats, they crawl into the oven, thinking it's a warm place to have an oven. BOOM! That's the end of the cat. It's tragic, really, I like cats. Now, there's no cat in the fresh bath, no cats, rats, or roaches to speak of. So, while you're waiting, I thought it might be nice if you lot had a wander next door. Do you know who lives next door to me? Yeah, Mrs. Sweetie Todd! The barber surgeon, oh he's a lovely man he is. He's a master with a cut throat razor, give you the shave of your life, you'll never need another one afterwards. Yeah, he's also a bit of a doctor and a dentist as well. That's why his barber's pole is red and white, you see. Stands for blood and bandages. Yeah, you can go in there, sit down, have your hair cut, your tooth pulled, your gammy arm and leg hacked off all in one go, all for a very reasonable price. And sometimes, when I send him customers for his shop, he brings me out some meat for my pies, isn't that nice of him? <laughs> yeah, you're not, you're looking a bit scruffy. Come if you could do a bit of hair coming, what in the world is going on on top of that head? <laughs> and you as well! Good Lord, it's, it's spreading! I'll tell you what, loves, I'll bring it down here and introduce you to Sweeney Todd right away. And then we'll be back to see the inside of my pie shop in some form or another, won't we? Yes, we will. Come on, this way, loves. <laughs> Get yourselves a seat now, anyway you like. 